I don't know how this began. It's been far too long. But it, at some point, it got into my head that... That, that Hassan was just blindly drinking this fucking vile purple liquid. Presented to him. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't slipped into without anything. A care, without a care in the world, just... Consume your purple drink! Yeah, soon the purple drink will finish him, yes. It wasn't he suspects nothing! It was just fucking chugging poison. One of Mel's oldest jokes back when she did her L L L L LP, when I, that was when I met her. All the way back in, like, mid-2009. I can't believe Mech is a fucking a rock band microphone and purple drink. Thanks, Windows Stranger Media things player. have happened. Thanks, to Windows Movie Maker. Oh god, Good Windows times. Movie Maker. L look, okay, I met Ray. I here's how this all went down. I moved to Quebec. Okay, I have no friends because all my friends. I lived in Nova Scotia. Which is like the easternmost wow. province of Canada my entire life. And you moved to my, Quebec. I moved to Quebec. Friends. My dad says we gotta move to Quebec. Because <clears throat> he's in the military. He's getting posted there. He can't, he has no say in the matter. Family's gotta go with him. Voop, voop. We gotta Quebec. You like that? <clears throat> and it's like for five years. So my whole life is just over. So I turned to the internet. Because. <laughs> I don't speak French. I don't know no one. School's not starting for another three months. I have nothing to do but play video games and go online. So I go online and I go on YouTube and I'm like, damn, this is funky fresh. I can watch videos all day long for free. What do I like? Man, that Fire Emblem game sure was fun. Why are there any Fire Emblem videos? Hey, what's that? This is like Fire Emblem. That Where's Priscilla? Why is there a bandit? What's going on? <laughs> and so it began. <laughs> wow. I would never have gotten the idea to actually sit down and record Fire Emblem 404 if not for a certain uh, LP or that Ray and I both know who unfortunately decided to disappear off the face of the earth, which is understandable. No one can do this for a living for that long. <clears throat> uh, a user by the name of Sevian? You remember Savian, right? Of course I do. He was the reason I got into LPing. Him and Proton John. Him and Proton John. And, and Voltage McCammer. Uh, um, uh, find who I... Savian was big for me and Ray because of Gemfire. Uh, Good old fucking Gemfire. Because Gemfire was this just... <sighs> what, what's that? Civil civilization, right? So it's like this, this tiny civ single continent where you pick a pick a country, and you build your forces, and you fight other ones, and you have to like tactics battle your way through stuff. <laughs> and uh, both of us were watching that, just like, oh, whoa, it's crazy. It was kind of romance with the king uh, kingdom esque, which helps because Koei made it. Yeah, and and I was like, damn, Savvy's gonna play Fire Emblem, and he did. And Savvy and I actually got to talking for a while on Skype, and he was like, haha, you're gonna finish your FE404 playthrough before I finish my FE7 one. I did. He never finished that FE7 playthrough. <laughs> Oof. Um, yeah, just, I, I was like, dang, I need a microphone, but I don't have any money because I'm 2009, 16. Uh, I don't have a job. I'm going to school. My parents will not buy me a microphone because they'd ask me 10 million questions of what I'm using it for. My rock band microphone has a USB. My computer has a USB slot. <gasps> She's cracked the code. I put two and two together and I used a rock band microphone to record videos online for the next four years. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, and the you worst part like was. That sometimes. The worst part was, I had friends that had microphones that died, headsets that broken, the quality was terrible. I'm using a fucking plug-and-play microphone from the Wii version of Rock Band, and it lasted and sounded better than microphones that people had professionally over the course of those years. Strange time, right? <laughs> uh, so I sat down. I steal, and then something bad happened from another person we used to talk to. And I, I just, I make, I make shitty videos at 404. And Ray's like, "Wow, you're playing my game. Thank you very much." I, I was like, oh, to exposure. Ray <laughs> we start making videos together, and hanging out. I have now known Ray for 12 years. Yeah, how glorious 12 years it has been. I, 
you've aged! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh... The thing I remember most clearly from those old... Yo, I remember! Videos. Oh, Christian. Oh, I remember. Oh, you. You, 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 you. <laughs> what? It was you and Effie Lover 3. And... <laughs> What? It was nice. Turper and Effie Lover 3 because I thought you two were the same fucking person <laughs> for the longest time. I was, every time he was in chat, you'd show up, he'd stop typing, and then you'd start typing. And I'd be like, are you fucking with me, Matt? His name was Matt. <laughs> I have no idea. And you were like, is. and you were like, no, I'm, I'm, I'm Turper. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not this other person. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> I have no memory of this. I do. I have memory Ooh. of this. This is pretty funny. Christian Gandalf right now. I have memory of this place. <laughs> uh, I, I do remember an old. What was, the, what was the thing you got you into the calls? What was the first joke you made that made me like? Uh, right, uh, it wasn't what made, got me into the call, but it was what made you pay attention to me. <laughs> <laughs> it was a gotcha. It was when you were playing gotcha boards. Yeah. Yeah, and. And you, you were explaining why you liked the game, uh, and you said it's fun and broken. And I think I said like my <laughs> dick. <laughs> you did. You did, Chris. Like my dick. Huh? Uh, it's <laughs> fun and broken, and he's just like my dick. And I'm just like, <laughs> damn you, Turper! <laughs> How dare you make me laugh at such crude and juvenile humor? Yeah. Oh. Uh. Anyway, look at the screen. Hey, it's Cruz! Why Do does I... he look like this? Good fucking question! Why don't you explain that, right? In a second. I gotta go over the characters first. Alright. Same that the villagers here don't want trouble. Else, Cruz would open a can of boat. Whoa. Right then. First, Marsha. So Marsha was, like was like a no-brainer. She is she is and still is my favorite Pegasus Knight in the series. Love her. She's so cool. Uh they're not uh, Ray, big on uh, Florina, especially back then. Ray lived in an era where all the Peg Knights were Meek or Tana. <laughs> and <laughs> there was no real winning there. Uh we're we're less harsh on Tana nowadays, but Marsha came in and was just a fucking breath of fresh air of Peppy. Oh, Tana. No, fuck him up, Tana. Like, she's second. She's at, she's second after Marsha. I've been owned! Marsha was breath, breath of fresh air for me because she came in and she was peppy and no, doesn't give a shit and anti Florina and just talking shit with the MC and fighting dudes and no fear, no nothing. It's great. Crackers. Cheese and crackers. So, yeah, Marsha has uh, some pretty good base stats. Higher defense than Florina, since for defense was one of Florina's lower points and she has she most has to back it up. She so, has very high stats. Yeah, she's pretty strong for this point. Like, Florina is already one of the best units in FE7 vanilla. So, yeah, Marsha just like kind of, kind of comes in and is like, yeah, I'm really good. Uh, so, Marsha has 65 I'm HP, you, but better. 40 strength, 50 skill, 55 speed, 25 defense, 40 res, 40 luck, and plus one and plus two con over average. Just makes she makes makes her a solid unit all around. Good. Peg con sucks. Peg con sucks. I'll give you a second cruise, I guess. Okay. Mark! It's my son, Cruz! Jesus Christ. It's your son, Cruz! His stats are immense. He's racist. Not... Fuck Will. This is my child. He's not Will. <laughs> Will, who's Will? This is my this son. This is like plus two, plus two, plus two over Will. All right, elephant in the room first. Uh, so, Major Union <laughs> is a fun game. We just wish we just finished Get playing it through it. So big. Uh, one of the core tenets I had when spriting in, uh, at the time was I wanted to try to adapt to the art style of the characters as closely as I could within my ability. So, <laughs> with the uh -huh. Major Union characters. <laughs> I nah. tried to match them as close as I could with the art style, given the limitations uh, of the GBA portrait oh. editing. Oh, I have the realest question for you now. So, you you put a, you put Cruz in here, and you put uh, you put you put Milner in later. Where's uh, where's Durant? 
He would have. He figured he would have been a shoe in game replacing one of uh, San or Kent, but yeah, I yeah. figured he would have like just fucking deleted Kent. Like, <laughs> like full the, the stop. I honestly don't. I honestly can't, can't give him a satisfactory answer to that. I like. I think. I think the roster was just like good and locked at a certain point. By the time I was just like picking dudes left and right, uh, I didn't really think about where what I would do, because, like, if I think- I thought about, like, putting Durant there, and, like, I figured, like, if I had to put- if I had to put in there, I'd have to put an Idris somewhere, and I could- Because <laughs> I feel like- I wasn't gonna ask about Idris, because we all know our feelings on Idris. Like, oh, regardless of my- must have been much stronger back then. Regardless of how I feel toward Idris, especially back then, but- I felt like those two were, like, the peas in the pod, like, I couldn't really get put one in the other, like- like, this is just me trying to think of an answer, because like, I really just cannot give you a proper answer. Like, I don't that's really fair, know. That's fair, that's <laughs> fair. It's, it's happened so long ago. Mm. Well, we know it's changed for the F404 remake, anyway. Thank you, Lucky. So anyway, yeah, um, down to the art style as much as I could, with mixed results. Given with well, Melonor might... doesn't need Adria. Melonor is... Melonor's existence in Adria sort of was just there to help Adria in the first part, and then he was promised a castle, and he was kind of like, Cool castle, fuck you! Yeah, he's like the other main character, like... They, they don't really have... They're not really, like... They don't interact that much, other than being on the screen talking about the same thing. Idra definitely uh, interacts with Durant much more, and Milner interacts with uh, Killier and himself more than Idra. Uh... What else? So with Cruz and Cruise? some other characters, uh, I did I did an attempt when I, were, I attempted to uh, re uh, reboot FE404 and FE4 in FE405. I gave Cruz and a bunch of other characters portrait updates, and uh, one of the first things I did was make Cruz adapt into my own uh, art style at the time, and it looked a lot better. I agree. I can't blame 405 for never coming to fruition. Ray really burnt himself out trying to make ASD work several times. I did. It was like uh, several years in a row trying to do this labor of love that I didn't really get a whole lot of support for because the ROM hacking community of the ROM hacking was uh, not as kind as it is nowadays. And I, and I kind of yeah. got a bit lambasted for it. So and the thing I know about Ray, when he gets burned and burnt uh, out, of, out of something, he doesn't go back to it for a long time. Aw, I like this one. It's cute. Yeah, it's really good. Ray did his son credit. Uh, it's, it's pretty. It's pretty great. So yeah, when I when I finally got to it during the middle of uh, Secret Five, I was like, yeah, this, this is gonna work out. And like a year later, Effie Builder fin was finally released, and I was like, oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Had I lasted just a little bit longer, I probably would have gone through it because Effie Builder is such a fantastic program. Mm -hmm. Effie Builder is pretty fucking great, just from no, using it to look at things. <laughs> anyway, uh, Cruz, <laughs> uh, is, as you can see, he's like what much stronger than Will, and his uh, his growth, he's got uh, some nice growths to match. 80 HP, 50 strength, oh. 55 skill, 50 oh. speed, 30 defense, oh. 25 res, 40 luck. Oh, he is your big time archer until you get Luna later. He's your son. <laughs> He's your son through and through. I like yeah, too. You did a really good job on all the battle palettes, I think. He's your archer until you replace him. Yeah. Well, um, I did my best trying to move characters and strengths of character palettes because I didn't know. I didn't really w didn't do a very good job of like balancing colors within uh, the 16 uh, color limit back then as I did back uh, with uh, like some recent cruise ports you've seen there. Like, I did a much better job of keeping him on brand with his color scheme. I got to and I would have done the, same, done the same with Marsha. Had I had the skill. I was expecting her to have a sword. I don't know why. Pop, Pop quiz. quiz. Hot too much to count. <laughs> Meanie. <laughs> Jerk. Oh, uh, I love Sassy tutorial, Ray. <laughs> Some people should. Big meanie poo poo head. Mm. Meanie. Just meanie. It's fucking it's great. It's so great. Did I raise the base stats of the archers any? Let me see. No. A little bit. They have three strength now instead of one. <gasps> wow. 
two more strength. <laughs> Amazing. So still, powerful. Still have double effectiveness, by the way. Hey, it's Meagle. Strong dude. Searching foe Searching love. Searching foe love. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> How did no one I, find well, this? He's horrified his by his own doing. How Searching no foe love. How did no one find this? Hey, Ray, what's the sea life description? <laughs> <laughs> they're heavy! I mean, GBA con is like, what? They're heavy! I mean, they get. No, it's like, just GBA steel axes are just fucking awful. Like. Who is this? I mean, nowadays, like, I'm like, I don't give a shit. They give, them, they give increased weapon experience how fuck, and their E rank. How fucking yeah, let's go. <laughs> hey, you know what else has a low weapon rank and gives a lot of weapon experience? Don't say <laughs> the it. The devil axe, duck? I didn't say it. Look, every time I play FE7 now, I just buy all the steel axes as soon as I'm ready to promote a calf. So I can get S rank pallets. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Good thing this is not the, the dynamic between Cruz and fucking Amelia. Like, this will be a much different uh, outcome. Yahoo! I understand. Down, Jazar, down. No devil axes, damn, Jazar. Keep it in your pants! It's Friday, right? It's a good Friday? It's Friday. Yeah. It's okay, Friday. I'm just making sure I open the right fucking pillbox here. Chalky Tree was a fancy Australian who was doing, who was a, a Josh can fill this in more because he was, because he probably shouldn't remember more about this, but uh, he was the one uh, who uh, created the parse, the text editing suite all the way back in uh, 2006 for uh, the GBFEs, because he was the one who helmed the FE6 translation at the time. With a uh, fire lizard. And they were just trying to uh, hash it out, because uh, trying to get in that, that in was a uh, bit of a bit of a trial, we should say. So before they could make. No! <laughs> before, they, before they made <laughs> the, like the, the proper one that they would use for the translation proper. <laughs> Uh, the, this preliminary text editing suite came out, and this is the one that I use. It's what uh, you made, and, uh, well, editing text was... <sighs> it's a headache. Oh, yeah, it's baby. A goddamn headache. Alright, so, <laughs> remember the thing that Mel said about trying to make sure the ROM stayed, in, stayed intact as you were trying to make things work? Mm-hmm. And trying to make sure you would stayed within the limit. Tech, the text parser had a hard and fast rule about that. If the total, if the total uh, size of the text file that uh, you were editing exceeded the, the vanilla limit by any amount, then the text parser wouldn't properly import the text and it would fail. So, so not only did you have to use this ancient fucking text parser, you couldn't add more than what was already there without it going Bleh. So at, the, at that point it became a question of, oh boy, what do I get rid of to free up text space? So immediately, the tutorial text, rewrite as much of this as I can and get rid of the stuff that, that no people, no average player would see. So yeah, that, bam, done. Next on the list was, I didn't think, I wasn't thinking about, uh, Adapting Hector mode at the time, like I thought about it, but I knew it was, I knew it was like a gamble at best. So any like specific Hector mode dialogue, some of it I kept, but others that were on that were on the chopping block, I just get, got rid of that. And then some other unused conversations. There were there weren't that many, but any of those came along. I I uh, axed those as well. And I ended up getting having up quite a bit of free space after a while. I did have to like go back and forth every now and again, just like, oh, I, I went over the limit again. 
and just keep removing some nonsense text or trying to trim down some of the dialogue because I did get with some of the conversations I did add into the game. I got a little, I got a little ahead of myself, and you can th you you know how I got with ASD. I can't believe that Ray's powers of extra long conversation were contained because he was not allowed to go over a limit. <laughs> Thanks, Twelve Kid Tree. That's what he gets for inserting the bins. I can't believe you were defeated by an Australian. They got their ass kicked by birds. How could you lose, Ray? You really w got done down under. I sure did, eh? That's it. <laughs> he was wordy? Wow, really? You don't say? Yeah, but that's fine. It unfortunately just doesn't suit a farm. <laughs> that's the problem with a lot of farm hacks, especially back then, was uh, they just got really wordy. And that'd be fine for a story, but Fire Emblem's quick and snappy, you know. Spend 10 minutes of the dialogue, go, go to your next map. Even some hacks nowadays still do it. Like, I know that Vision Quest got wordy from time to time. It had, I think, it had one offensive moment of overwordiness when uh, Titus was talking to Excella in, in, in Kuching. I'm glad like that, that was... we we're both thinking of the exact same fucking conversation. <laughs> I think that was the one moment in Vision Quest where too much dialogue. But that's about all I can think of. Uh, everything else is snappy enough. Land monkey. <laughs> For love. <laughs> Looking for love? Clampy! No. Looking for love. Need to try to get better into character with writing Marsha, because she's so much fun to write. Clampy. But, but uh, we didn't have, I didn't think we had the supports dumped yet. Like on SF. I guess SF, 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 SF wasn't even born yet. <laughs> As if, yeah, it didn't exist until like 2009, 2010. How long did it take to like download the like 10 megabytes that the original FE7 ROM was? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Are you doing this on dial-up, Ray? Uh, dial-up? Uh, no. I, I had a broadband by, by then. Nice. A broadband? Oh, I'm so old! Ah! Wait, was, hold on, what year was this again? Like... <laughs> that story was in 2006! 2006? God. I finished my How? 2009. I didn't even play RuneScape for another like two years. <laughs> God, <laughs> Doug! <laughs> God's protect. Doug, we're fucking sick going on seven. Oh my god. I didn't know what a fucking computer was when I was this young. <laughs> I hate that we're going through this and we're being reminded of how baby Duck is. Ugh, he's so fucking small. Well, that's why he's here, right? You cannot forget. Yes, it, this is, this was my tour. That's what it is. <laughs> I still think it's funny when you bring up this is made like 2006 and stuff. I didn't play this hack till like 2012. I think this was still actually just the first one. Here he comes. You had an opportunity to remove Sane's dialogue. I did I have an opportunity, but not quite. I mean, I like Sane's character. He's a he's a he's a bold faced flirt, but he never gets creepy about it. He never gets creepy about it, and he doesn't get any parent ending, so he's just weenie. It's like it's one. Not. On vanilla, he gets three. No. Yeah. Does he? Yeah, Fiora, Rebecca, and Priscilla. I forgot about the other two. I was gonna say Fiora. Oh boy, Fiora. both the red and green calves can get with Wait, Fiora. Wait, no, I thought only Fiora was a paired, and then the other two were just regular them. ending still. No, they no, they, they went after him. Be cautious, Ron. Be you cautious. know what territory we approach. Oh! <laughs> Ryan! The dangers that lurk was in. Mm. All right, I, I got that out of the way. How you guys doing? Zach <laughs> Ryan! <laughs> yeah, Zach Ray's right. Check this out. Vision. 
Put ya! Okay, they did have one. Gotcha. Okay. I'm when done. your grandfather died, Lin asked that Kay Lin be taken under Ossian protection. Sane requested a discharge and moved to Foray with his beloved Rebecca. Their son is nothing like his father, thankfully. <laughs> Fuck's sake, Dad! <laughs> yeah, he was an archer. Among uh, other things. It did happen. You know, Pandan, I... There's so many coincidences in the Fire Emblem community that I, I do have to wonder if there's someone at Intelligence Systems that just is a member that reads the shit. Because I... Oh, I think something got put into, um... Like a Fire Emblem hack, like a year before Three Houses came out that was like the exact fucking mechanic. I'd have to search through old stream videos to find out what we were talking about, because I remember this being a, a, a thing that we joked about. There was dastardly foes at intelligence systems. Stealing things without giving credit. From our stolen things that we didn't give credit. Mm-hmm. But I will still never forget Christian's moment of, the next Fire Emblem game will be an FE2 remake. And then suddenly. Yeah. Suddenly. And it was. <laughs> it was during Dark Souls 2. Yeah. I'll still always remember an old SF post uh, like a couple years, it was a couple years after TLP and Fates was on the way and somebody posted like on Blazer's old TLP thread where he was like, did you see this? They have a weapon named Siegfried and the Raijinto looks like Raikiri and I'm just sitting there holding my holding my head in my hands and just crying. <laughs> <laughs> What's my cash? I'm just office? sitting there like, ah, no, they made your game. Hey, it's Xion. It's Miss doesn't appear as a unit in this game because Ray didn't want to put her Xion into the would, class. Xion and, uh, would have taken even more work than Sora, all right? And he didn't want to yeah. try and make an animation for her, Ben. I can't Wait, blame him. You were playing. What? <laughs> yeah, we're playing. Catch the bomb, baby. <laughs> he, he was planning on putting Kingdom Hearts 2 style Sora. Wow. 2006 was a different time, okay, Ron? It was I, uh, a different time. Where I, was I, I in 2006? I respect the tenacity. I'm glad oh, you, you do. I was in Nova Scotia. But she was higher in the priority for characters oh, that I like, so I put her in over Sora. Her ear is so tiny. Her ear is very it's tiny. <laughs> <laughs> that is it's tiny. I'm 24 years old. 2006 <laughs> is 15 years ago? Ugh. I was in elementary school. Ugh. I was in high school. I was in. Oh, you're sick. old. I was. In I yeah, was yeah. I'm 28, Zach. Hi, have we met? I was in school. Oh. Oh God. Jesus. 2006. I was in sixth grade. The monster sneaking up on me. Fetus. <laughs> he was not fetus. He was six. Okay, give him some credit. He could walk. <laughs> I remember. Now that we're on an. Nostalgia tripper. I remember an old, old path of radiance. Path of radiance playthrough. And Tiborn shows up with his crew. And there's something about coconuts. And it cracked me up. Coconuts. 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 Tiborn and coconuts. Yes. So Surge and Lena oh. don't appear in this, but this person sure does. I don't remember Tabarn and Coconuts. I remember Arabian Tabarn, and I sang Tunak Tunak Tun once. Jesus yeah. Christ. Aging herself even more. Oh, yeah. I don't remember Coconuts. Uh, uh, what was I going to say? Shit. Her coconut gun can fire in spurts. Coconuts was lean? You're gonna have to explain that one. You it's got a blue arrow. Yeah. It's gonna hurt. Yeah. In the um, in the chapters, you know, when they first show up in the forest. Yeah. Oh, oh I think it was a joke about what she's actually saying because she's speaking in the fucking. She's speaking in the Heron language. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that checks out and my brain. I think, I think Ray made this joke. It was me. It yeah. was me. Yeah. I totally remember it now. <laughs> she's big. Yeah. Because we were like, man, I wonder what she's saying. And Ray just chimed in with his girl voice. Coconuts. Coconuts. <laughs> Faster. <laughs> History was made that day. There was also a joke about uh, Ranolf keeping his hand below the below the edge of the screen. 
Someone's like, y you, you don't know what I'm doing with this one. <laughs> this is, this, at all we told you, no more fucking won't pass me, what you fuck you're talking about. Never forget Sonic is Graham Crackers. Oh, I'm so <laughs> old! I remember that. I remember that. Fucking Omega Killer 446, I miss that guy. I miss him too. Was he also a Matt? I don't think he was. He was, was he? a Matt. So many <laughs> fucking Matts back in the day. He was the first Matt that we knew. Yeah. He was what the first Matt guys? that we knew. I hope he's doing well. Same, actually. I remember I talked to him on Facebook in like 2015, and he was like, Yeah, I'm doing good. Nice to hear from you. And I'm like, That's great, buddy. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Talk to you in another five years. <laughs> Yeah, he got too busy to keep doing what we were doing, and then we just sort of just stopped. Which is fair. It do be like that sometimes. What are some other old... Hey, Christian, I'm, I'm, I've aged enough today. <laughs> There's one I was watching, I don't remember. <sighs> old, you want an old YouTuber that still does stuff to this day that I still have subscribed to? Check out all these archers. Check out his random ass troubadour. You ready for this one, Christian? Yeah. Kikoski, uh... I don't know that one. You don't know that one? I do. <laughs> He's fucking Ray ancient, does. he is. <laughs> I... I do remember those... Oh, oh Kikoski, uh... Ah, but... There was some drama with that. I don't know if I should bring it up. <gasps> uh, I just remember Kikoski, uh, From way, way, way back in the day on YouTube, and... I found him through his XCOM videos of Enemy Unknown, like the original one. Or UFO Defense, that's what it is. Um, and I just fell in love with this this weird European man, not you, you were later, <laughs> uh, that was just, he, he's playing these old DOS games. And, and the, the, the playthrough that just made me like just love Kikoski's videos was Lands of Lore, <laughs> which is, the oldest DOS uh, click the panels to move game you could find. And I just, there was something just so charming about sitting on YouTube in 360p and watching this European man play a DOS game with a, with a crackly microphone and, <laughs> and an awkward tenor because he didn't have the, the same voice that he had later on in his other videos. It was just, ah, oh, I'm getting nostalgic. I miss being a teenager. <laughs> It's like it's like being friends with Bean now, and then you find his uh, his million view Mario Party video from like twelve years ago. Good lord, that is a thing, by the way. Wow. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Time Ray's for got me some... to go dig it out because we found it yesterday. <laughs> Ray's got some videos on his channel that have reached high numbers of views that do not contribute to anything in his life anymore. I sure don't. Yeah. The That's first, also a mood. The first Pokemon Stadium LP just like looms. The the first episode of Pokemon White looms in the distance. Mm -hmm. uh. <laughs> <laughs> Ever since the Rats Prey video on that, I stopped fleecing comments on that. Uh. I'm still here, Ray. I'm still here for White too. Let's do it. Maybe one day. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> this conversation is going a while. Yeah, <sighs> do you believe it? Because I try to put all these characters and have them all meet and meet and know each other. <laughs> the, the holy ten, as it were. Hey, kid, remember that time we did the thing? Oh, yeah, we did the thing with the dude. Oh, don't tell! <laughs> mm -hmm. For people watching this... Congrats, you finally beat a normal CPU. Beauty then. Warrior. Warrior. Watcha. Watcha. Alright, before we talk about Kid, uh, Shion, you can actually view her stats, like Natalie. But I did actually augment them, as you can see her. her she actually has stats. It's provided no one actually reaches her, you should be okay anyway. But, uh, her new base <laughs> stats are 16 oh, HP. Chat. 4 power, 7 skill, 9 speed, 4 defense, 2 res. She has uh, six, 6 luck as well. Chat, you're killing me. Still no combo, rip. Uh, and her description is chief engineer on a big project on vacation. <laughs> 18 episodes of Pokestar Studios. 
Look, it's gonna Thank be it. real funny, you having to pretend to like Pokestar. <laughs> we'll all enjoy it. Then so, good old kid. <laughs> uh, one of my favorite characters in Chrono Cross, full stop. She's awesome, she's a lot, she's a lot of fun, even, in, even if the plot just kind of derails on her halfway through. She's still just, like, one of my favorite female characters in f video games. Why were you in a real-life school? Anyway. <laughs> the Chrono Cross is weird, okay? Suddenly alien spaceship! Anyway. I'm, I'm not so hot on a Y2 playthrough because the mere idea of ditching a Snivy or a Riolu from your team rubs me the wrong way so much that it hurts. Well, what? Well, Chris, you'll, you'll be happy to know that if I do play Y2, I will be picking Snivy and it is uh, going to be Rosa's starter, so... Oh, Chris, dude. Riolu is fair game, though, for, like, whatever. I got, I got, I got two comments one day on the black and white two videos and this one person was just like I can't believe you listened to these people and ditched your starter you just abandoned your starter and for a freaking seal I don't care if you were paid for it you just lost a ton of respect for me with that move and whoever suggested you <laughs> should use a seal guy, bro. or Samurat had less brain cells than an average human being of their age <laughs> He's got this fucking, he's got this fucking memorized. He absolutely loves it. He has it on lock. <laughs> oh, my favorite is fucking <laughs> an average human being of their age. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! That guy really thought he was gonna do something that wasn't get made fun of, huh? I thought. I think <laughs> that comment's still there. I don't think I deleted it. It's there. It should Go be ahead. there, yeah. Unless you did something oh, to it. I, uh, I must completely miss that comment. Holy shit. Uh, it's it's years old good. now, Ryan. Uh, I'll, I'll grab it. Yeah, I'll never forget again. Freedom Planet Guy. It Fucking hell. Freedom Planet Guy! That was, uh, that was on my Planet channel. Freedom Planet Guy. Uh, uh, I was waiting for the current conversation to finish before I talk, before I talk about Kid. So. Wiki user 92. Mm-hmm. First off, he's him. a wiki user. I found him. Stop talking to me, I hate my voice. Oh my god. Mm. Hold on, Christian. Uh, you missed this one, which is just clearly Ray being on his alt. Don't you dare talk bad about Pokestar Studios. That place is awesome. It's fun, and you can get awesome item rewards. <laughs> <laughs> Here's two more. Here's two more genius comments. For, for a wiki user, he sure has a really shitty... You missed Fuck, a lot of word? useful items and experience while rushing through Castelia. Patience is a virtue. Your research, Joint <laughs> Avenue, does still work. There are NPCs that visit it every day, and you can see still develop it with them. What? <laughs> <laughs> Even if it's slower than the now unavailable method. Oh my god. You can god, see for somebody who's a wiki user, he sure hasn't opened a fucking thesaurus. Here it is, here it is. Here's the exact comment. You just abandoned your starter. <laughs> For a freaking seal! Who is just used a seal of rest? Sarah has less brain cells than an average human being of their age. I laughed real good at that one. Jesus. Well, I, I'm glad that your only reply is just Lamau. They have not commented since. <laughs> Can I talk about kids gross now? Yes, I'm yes. sorry. No. Okay. <laughs> okay, so kids gross. Uh, she. Uh, 60 HP, 40 strength, 50 skill, 65 speed, 25 defense, 30 res, 45 luck. Due to how, how things work with uh, trying to edit classes, I didn't really uh, have much to wiggle room, and obviously Assassin is not a fit for Kid, she's more of a rogue, but I couldn't put import the rogue animation, and so I had to make do. So she classes up into Super Thief via Earth Seal. Super Thief. <laughs> Yeah, I, I remember, because the female assassin animation d doesn't exist, full stop, uh, and there was no no uh, no no Fedder, so no importing animations. So Ray was just like, 
Oh god. Jeez. Continue. Oh, it was just shit. like, uh... Yay! Earth Steel, do it again! So it's like, it's Super Thief is just Thief again, but it has higher higher caps and plus 15 crit. That's hey. it. Nice. So Does he have the... lethality, right? No, no lethality. Damn. Uh, so one thing I wanted to bring up is that years ago, before I worked on FE404, I actually made a battle animation for Kid. So, uh, trying to simulate one of her critical uh, animation, like one of her... What she used to uh, to attack with, I have it right here. Uh, I'll just put this up on. Uh, I don't think I can share this one. On... No, I no on push. I can. This is I made this back in like 2005, 2004. This. Oh, it's dated 2006. Okay, August 28, 2006. Can't believe they stole Rogue from you, Ray. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, let me uh, let me see if I can this on on push, guys. I can't believe all that this animation needs is like another really good slice, and it did still be perfectly fine. Yeah. Kind of spin right round. So yeah, that was the, that was the dream of the time. <laughs> I could try to implement that animation into it with before when custom animations were a thing, and I could totally do it now, but. It's, I still make I still make frames for it, so yeah. Eh, you get you your kid as she is. She'll kick your ass so hard, kiss the moon, the not etc. So fun thing about this about this brigand here in vanilla FE seven when the, these guys reinforce, they have <laughs> C rank and swords. I remove that. I, I could simply change them to mercenaries, but I'm like ah. But give them as a brigands. It's fine. They did have C rank swords, huh? Yeah. They did. Fucked mm -hmm. up. They were st they were also still in Tactics Universe. As you remember were. that. They were. Good Zack. <laughs> the paint aged words of <laughs> Tactics Universe. There's some nostalgia for you. No, that's not nostalgia. That's regret. <laughs> that's regret. It's a little bit of regret. Oh, we called it sin. Anyway. We called it sin. It got better. Sub a gub? Oh. So now we have Kid. Uh, so now you have uh, you two thieves now, because Ray had to keep Matthew for event reasons. So, uh. Go nuts. Yeah, have fun. Have fun uh, opening massive lock, massive lock picks. Steal every two, th two thieves in uh, chapter uh, sixteen. Gonna gonna fly by. The epitome of balancing. <laughs> this game's not fucking balanced. <laughs> I know. Four four is a labor of love. That does hey, not mean that made he's not. Know. He's not. You know. I, I think I only like give him some like HP and that's it. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Astro is pretty good. <laughs> Lol, said the scorpion. Lamal. <laughs> mm. Oh, get him, Lanoan. Oh, yeah, fuck him up. Oh, I should magic. probably talk about Prison Pillar, huh? Yeah, what is that, right? So, back when I first attempted to uh, put in, uh,. Put in a PRF weapon for Linoan. I thought about bringing Nosfera 2 over, like her version of Nosfera 2 over wholesale from Thracia, since when you uh, recruit Linoan in uh, FE5, you can also pick up her uh, Nosfera 2 tome that's in the chapter pre prior, and that's a B rank like tome. And then the only other character that can use it at that point is, class is a classed up uh, Homer. It's Thaney? Oh no, Ray hadn't played that game yet. Unless. Oh, nice. No, not quite. Um, actually, Radiant Dawn was just like on the hovering of being released at the time. Yeah. Another thing that they stole from Ray. How about that? <laughs> so, mm -hmm. when I implemented a Prison Pillar for the first time, I actually tried to give the Nosferatu effect to it. That didn't really work out because uh, <laughs> the the HP recovery code uh, code is hard coded to the animation in Nosferatu. And I couldn't really give it the Nosfera to because the Nosfera to proper is still in the game. I couldn't copy it, like recolor it or anything at the time, because that wasn't the thing yet. 
and when properly when you use this effect in battle, the HP absorption works, but it, but it produces some buggy results. So like well when like it doesn't display the HP healing, and then when the enemy attacks, it'll display no damage, and then when the battle's over, you'll see that you'll have your HP healed. It looks really awkward, and I try to make things look as uh, aesthetically pleasing as possible. So ooh, bugs like that were a no one, no no. So I decided, ah, just, fuck it, I'll just ma make it an infantry slayer. So it's just Thaney now. Before Thaney went Thaney existed. before Thaney. I cannot believe that IS keeps ripping us off, right? <laughs> Fucking devils. A lot we of them. We should sue. We should sue. And there's a troubadour here for some reason. Ah, I thought, I thought this, this crew could use, use the random healer. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, that's Too bad enemy AI for healing just does not work. It doesn't work. The, 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 the hustle, the hustle. Well, that healing worked. Enemy AI, worked. enemy AI will not heal unless the target is within like 10% of their uh, HP. <laughs> and an enemy could be at half, and the healer would just fucking sit next to them and not do anything. Such is the power of GBA. It do be like that. <laughs> Man, <damn. gasps> Oh no! Oh. It's alright. Oh, you almost got a game over in your own video game. It happens. I thought you were the Lord God of 404. I'm not. I just make this. What? What? You just you just hack fire and you don't play make it? You just make FE404 and you don't play it. Hey, as long as we're spouting memes. Is that what you're telling me? Ugh. Duck, I made the decision to not absorb all of my Archangel weapons from the box immediately and then set feed them to Sarasa, and I'm regretting this. Sounds regrettable. I've clicked so many times. Gotta click uh, more. Soma Cruz! Get strong! Please! He'll be fine. I have. No doubt in my mind that cruise just be dead. You, know, you don't even have a vulnerary anymore. Well, you can just hang back here then and hold. Well, I was trying to look for my phone, then I forgot that it's sitting on on my computer running Twitch. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> well done. Ray, I have a quest, John, for you. That's what we're here for. Well, it's actually not about this. Oh, okay. Um. It's about uh, F we seven if. Go on. <laughs> yes. And um, I, I got reminded of it because I remember that if you beat the boss in this map, he drops a dragon shield in that. How do you feel about stat boosters with multiple uses, but give the same stats? Uh, depends on the game, really. If uh... so, like, like the dragon shield was changed to three uses, so it's plus one on the stat gain because three uses. But it's plus one each time, so you can spread the defense between characters, like uh, like guidance statues. Yeah, that's pretty mu that's pretty much uh, on a game by game basis, I think. Like stuff like that will have to depend on the, how the game itself is meant to be played. Like I think like because that because that would imply a lot of uh, mixing and matching to uh, min max your characters as as you see fit, and that's fine. I actually like, do like, like that. I like, like in Gaiden and uh, Child's of Valencia. I, I like that a little bit. If, uh, yeah, you, want, if, you, wanted to, kind of if you wanted to design your game around that sort of a stat boosting economy, I'd be down. Yeah, I'm super into the idea. I just brought it up because of the boss again. But, uh, I think it'd be nice to be able to not have to commit a whole two points of defense to someone if you wanted to spread them out just to characters that might only need one or... Barth. Share the load. Share the load. Load the share. I'll find that that share the load image again because it was. Oh, really good. transfer the data. Transfer the data. Queen, Darth the reactor. Transfer <coughs> the data. Nice. <laughs> transfer the iron lens. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> hey, Ron. Mm. <laughs> I feel that. Uh, was it you who was talking about cleaning the car? Oh no, I cleaned my car a while ago. Can't remember. Like, think... It might have been Ace. I've been Ace. Oh. Oh. So dark. What's up? What do you think so far? I mean, what do you, what do you think so far with the stock? The, the technical standpoints are extremely impressive, and the rest is a product of its time. Fair, <laughs> so smooth. What a You're way to tell Ray to go. <laughs> way to tell Ray to go fuck himself. <laughs> <laughs> that is a very loose interpretation of the words that came out of my mouth. <laughs> very loose interpretation. <laughs> Oh, Battle loses the shirt I'm wearing. <laughs> Ray, Ray, your hack is has interesting mechanics and is a product of its time. I guess I will go fuck myself. Alright then. <laughs> <laughs> that sounded like a verbal assault, assault to me. To me. <laughs> oh, just the phrase products of its time is such a cutting edge. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Hope you don't mind tagging me along. I do mind, kid. I do mind, kid, if that even is your real name. Lay off. <laughs> kid, if that is your real father. Kid, why aren't you in Japan? Why aren't you in school, kid? I bet your real name is Billy! The kid. Billy the kid? B Billy the kid. Anyway. Hey, look, she almost two face sprites. Wow! Because her, her hairstyle is very unique in episode one. Her ear is um, ever so slightly bigger in this. Because the, the braid obscures it. <laughs> so Shion cameos with uh, Linda Wins crew and ch occasionally chimes in dialogue every now and then to remind you that, yes, yeah, she exists and is part of the party. She's here. She's still here. Trust hey, her. She's here. Is she gonna do She'll something? She'll be here. She's still here, source dude, trust me. Source yeah. dude, trust me. 